being able to post long form video on Instagram is possible thanks to IGTV. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can post a video to Instagram TV using both desktop and mobile. By the way, my name is Desiree and on this channel, I help you grow your business with better social media and content marketing. Now you might have a video that you're ready to post right now, but maybe you're struggling with ideas and not knowing what else that you can make. So why don't you go grab my list of 50 videos that every business and brand should make to help them move their video marketing strategy forward. All right, now let's head over to the computer first where I'm gonna show you how to post your videos to Instagram TV through Creator Studio and then afterwards, I will show you how you can do it on mobile. Okay, so when you're trying to upload a video to IGTV on desktop, you're gonna to need to do this from Creator Studio. You can find Creator Studio at this link here at the top. To do this, you go into Create Post and you click IGTV. You're gonna select the account that you wanted to post to and then you're going to just work through this. So file to upload, we're going to pick our video. It can be horizontal. You can also make it vertical if you would like to. Because this is one of my YouTube videos, I have my title and everything already. And I'm going to use this snippet of the description. You can make your description super long if you want and you can also include links to things on your IGTV video that are actually clickable, which you cannot do on a regular Instagram post. The next thing I'm going to suggest that you do is that you wanna make sure you have your hashtags in here for search. So add in your hashtags and then we're gonna go and we're going to go to cover image on the right hand side and we're going to upload our custom image. Now I made this cover image that you can see right here for um, this size specifically. As you can see, it has to be a nine by 16 aspect ratio. If you need it to auto generate one, what it's going to do is create a kind of like a whole library that you can choose from, but they're gonna be from the farthest left hand side of the screen that you can see. And since this is a vertical video, it means it's gonna be like this part of the screen. Now the middle, which you would think, but it's gonna be this side of the screen. Since I like to control my image on when it comes to Instagram, because Instagram is very image oriented, I always try to have my own cover image created. Back to my post invo, do I want to share a preview on my feed? So this means that it will show up in the grid. I, You can choose that if it's part of your aesthetic. For the case of this, I'm going to say no. And then you can also choose to post it to your page from here if you want to as well. I'm gonna go down here to the bottom. I can schedule this to go up wherever I want it to go, date and time, or I can just publish it now. And as you can see, your post is publishing to Instagram. If I go up to my Instagram account, this is um, what it looks like on desktop. This is my um, Reels tab. I'm just gonna hit refresh to see if it's gone up. Now, after it's done processing by Facebook, you can see that it shows up the way I want it to look on Instagram TV on desktop and I can click on it and watch the video in horizontal mode. Okay, so how to post something to IGTV from the app on your phone. As you go to the IGTV app on your phone, you hit the plus sign in the upper right hand corner and whether you are um, recording something, that's when you would do this here, but I am going to upload a pre-recorded video. So I'm going to select this one right here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Facebook business page. I'm going to hit next. I'm actually going to pick my image I want to choose. What's kind of nice is you can kind of very specifically pick in here. Unlike the desktop where you're just stuck with the, the far left side, you kind of get a like it's gonna put it right in the center for you, which is kind, which is which is super nice. But I'm gonna upload from gallery because I every time I can I'm going to. I created this uh, photo and I uh, emailed it to myself essentially um, and downloaded it to my phone. I'm gonna hit next and then this is where I'm gonna go into my title and description. If I want to add it to a series, I can. So I can say maybe create my first series. My series name is gonna be called Vlogmas. I can go down here and edit my cover, watch time, make it visible on Facebook. You can go into advanced settings and see if like you have like a sponsor you have to add. You can put that on here, okay? And then I'm just going to hit post. Go to my profile. As you can see, I have it uploading, which means it's gonna take a minute to upload and then process um, through the Instagram system.
All right, and once it's in processing, this is what it looks like. We can just go in here. In this video, I'm going to show you how video, And it's all done. When you go into Instagram, this is how it will look. As you can see, I have it showing up on my newsfeed. Or I can go over to my Instagram stories tab and see it here as well. Now, Instagram has done a lot of crazy things with its interface to make it better for users, offer you more tools and service, and basically give you more options as a creator and a user. So in this video right here, you're going to learn all about the new interface, where everything is, and how it works. And if you're interested, watch this video right here because YouTube thinks that you're really going to like it. And until next time, I'll see you soon.